I like that you're not a minister because you can probably me an- too. probably answer this question for me. <laughs> we'll um, see. Donald Trump, is he racist? Yes. 100%? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. He's um, not, an, a, not an inclusive person who brings people together. He divides people. And what he is saying is absolutely 100% racist. The um, particular attack on the squad, mm. the go home, when... When Come three on. of them are from America <laughs> and one of them is uh, naturalised. But what we thought was interesting was just today, I think, or yesterday, in the last 24 hours, Quinnipiac's come out with a poll. And I think it's the first time mm. that more than half of the 1,300 mm. people polled mm. say Donald Trump is racist. Wow. So um, I wouldn't have believed that that poll came out with that. That's interesting. 51%. 45% wow. do not. Obviously, when you go and separate it into the parties, it's even higher. But, but that's a but that's a movement away. Yeah, from, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. interesting. So it's interesting that oh. I did look at the um, you know, the breakdown of who was the who was actually polled, and it looks to be you know third, third, third of independents, Democrats. Right. Uh, not quite that because there's a few others as right. well. Right. Um. So it seems seems pretty legit. Legit. And Piac is a pretty legit source. S- standard enough poll yeah um a good indicator of some movement look we can do better with our leaders i mean we can aim for leaders who can unite people who can resist the the contesting narratives and pit people against each other we can do far better than that i'm inspired by the squad i'm inspired by what the values that they're putting up i'm inspired by their political savvy I'm inspired by a new generation of leadership. I hope to get to meet them one day. I can't wait. Um, and we can do better than divisive, dog-whistling leadership. And I think I'm loving seeing a demand for a better type of leadership. 